Hey, what's happening? My name is Spud Too Tight, music producer, keyboardist, and show host for the Producers Corner with Spud Too Tight. How you doing? I'm A. Raphael. I'm with Moving Pictures Film and Music Production. <laughs> Owner and operator. <laughs> All facets and assets. <laughs> <laughs> And we're excited to bring you my personal studio configuration, VSC, Virtual Studio Configuration. For years, musicians have been posting things all over the web. What is the most effective way of transferring your audio between chat parties within a chat service in stereo? Well, today, I have the solution for you. VSC is an out-of-the-box studio configuration wiring process that allows audio to be streamed directly from your studio sound card or analog setup in stereo. So the old traditional days of using a standard USB microphone to communicate within the chat parties, those days are over. Now listening to the sound compared of playing your music over a USB microphone and using VSC as a wiring configuration to deliver your sound, is there a big difference you think in quality? Man, there's a major difference. I mean something as simple as, as an SM57 or 58. I mean, at least you get a solid quality Canon XLR three prong, call it what you will, it from your studio. I mean, that actually runs through a preamp, makes a world of difference. And to think of the distance that I'm sitting from this microphone now, I don't have to have it strapped to my head. I just, uh, I, I get to use what I'm comfortable, a tool that I've always used. The quality is is phenomenal I mean it's no different I hear how I'd monitor if I were in a recording session and using this so now we got highs we have mids we have lows and a lot of us are using synthesizers and some nice bright instruments out there man what about the clarity of sound man is it gonna sound cloudy that I'm used to hearing in some of these chat services and things None whatsoever. I think the clarity that this video has is a demonstration of how clear it actually is. I hear it just wonderful. I mean, if I were to record your voice, I could actually use it in video or film. I mean, it's a controlled environment. You, you have the uh, use of preamps, uh, solid you know, microphones, not USB. I mean, the, the, the tin sound is gone. I mean, it's just normal like you're used to. Now, what about the compatibility issues? Um, you use various DOS for tracking recording, and sometimes you're using an analog setup. Um, now, has this caused you to run any kind of compatibility issues for wiring and configuration? Um, is your studio still wired the same way that you usually kept it? Yeah, it's it's an addition to what you already have. If your MIDI setup is is how it is, or your uh, uh, your analog instruments. I mean, if it, I can, I have a sound stage here. I can record right off the sound stage, right in the VSC, if necessary. So n the only thing that changes is the addition to the configuration that takes no time to set up. I'd be surprised if it took more than 15 minutes. Half hour if you were just totally novice. What a major time saver because of the fact of setup and breakdown. Where I used to only be able to audition an individual, uh, maybe a couple individuals a day, I mean I can literally do if I give Every 15 minutes one, I mean, I can listen to four an hour where I only used to be able to listen to maybe one or two a day. Plus the, the, the time that they save in having to, you know, commute to where I'm at and set up and so forth. It's oh, the time saving factor alone and the fact that uh, I can do it from sitting right at my console is crazy. He put together a short video to give you a very basic introduction of working studio to studio with stereo sound. In addition to the stereo sound, we've also included file sharing, screen sharing to give us some more of an interactive experience of working studio to studio together. Again, I'm in Minneapolis and Raphael's down in Florida and we really didn't feel that 
um, speed and latency was an issue. Everything was coming in pretty quick and I didn't feel the lag and latency that most people are experiencing over the internet of working studio to studio across the web. I'll have to concur with that totally. No problems here whatsoever. So sit back and I guarantee you at the end of this presentation you're going to have a whole new outlook of working virtually across the web. That you will. Thanks for having me. I really enjoyed being here and uh, we'll get together again soon. Sounds good, ARPL. Take it easy, man. All right. Talk Peace. to you later, man. Peace. Hey, Raphael, what's happening, man? Spud, how you doing today, man? Pretty good, man. What's going on? Oh, man, enjoying the sunshine as usual here in Florida, you know? <laughs> <laughs> sure beats Minnesota, man. <laughs> yeah, man, you guys in that sub below, you know? <laughs> oh, it's cold here, man. <laughs> man. It was like 82 today. I'm all short-sleeved and chilled and you know oh okay. i envy you man <laughs> right so did you get the chance to check out that track i sent you man yeah man i sure did i liked it a lot and uh put a little bit on it i got some good ideas man i think i want you to hear them at least you yeah know? play it man let me check them out check this out all right <laughs> yeah, man. I'm loving that a lot. Yes, sir. That's it. Yeah, that's working. I mean, it leaves plenty of room for the vocals, and, you know, it's breathing a little bit. Totally. You know, so, so if you like them, I'll send them to you, you know? Yeah, send them to me right away, man. Let's upload that in my sequencer. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, good choice of synths, nice and bright, not overkilling the drums. I mean, just really fit perfect in the mix, man. Good choice. Thanks, man. Appreciate that. It is breathing. I liked it a lot, and uh, I think uh, we'll be able to do something with that. Right. I want you to work on it and see what you can get out of it, and uh, I'll give you my concepts for vocals. Okay. Well, it looks like I just received them. Let me generate a couple of audio channels here so I can import them. my first one second one and my third one and I'm gonna play them back Sounds just like here. Yeah, man, that came out really good, man. No sync so. issues. Fidelity was all there. Perfect quality. Yeah, I didn't have to change the tempo or anything. It was all right there, man. Yeah, man, that's working. You know, I want you to spend a couple of minutes on it and uh, see what else you can get going. And the next time you get some time, you drop those back to me and I'll do my thing. Sounds good, man. I got a couple of ideas right now I'm going to throw on them. Yeah. All right, man. I loaded the three tracks up. I bust the tracks that you sent me into a bus that I'm going to run an effect across the sense. Kind of switch it up a little bit, see how it sounds, and we'll play around with it and see which ones you like. And you give me the heads up, we'll just go through the next effect, the next effect, and so forth. All right, here we go. Now I'm looping it for four measures just so it loops back and forth until we find the run that we want anyways. All right, here All we right. go. If I 
something else. You like that one? I do. Okay. We'll keep I that like one. That, yeah. All like right. I like the way it, it cut in general because it almost put another another note in it. And, and that's kind of working with what I had planned for the vocal aspect of it. So that fit when I heard it to my ear. You know? Nice. Yeah. Okay. We'll keep it. That's a keeper. All right, man. So we got the audio files loaded. We got the effect of choice. It sounds good, man. I'm loving it. Sound good to you? Yeah, I liked it a lot, man. Good. I just, yep. I just, uh, I want to hear that again. All right, let me play that for you now. Sound good? That's working. Yep, I like that a lot, man. Great. Like so I'll work the track a little bit, man. I'll add a bass line on there, a few more synths. Funk up the, the arrangement a little bit more, man, and let you know when I'm done. Yeah, you should do that. I'm looking forward to hearing it. Cut it up. Drop that bottom. Let me see what's going on, man. Cool. I hit you up, man. When it's in, I'll send the files to the folder and let you know what's in the folder, and then you can just re-import it into your sequencer, and you'll be good to go. Excellent. Appreciate it and looking forward to it. Hey, Raphael, man. It's been great work with you, man. We'll hit up again, dude. All right, Spud. Talk to you soon, man. Peace. Peace.